How do you add mixed numbers? Let's look at this problem. 3 and 1 sixth plus 5 and 3 fifths. When you're going to add this problem, what you want to do is add the two whole numbers first. So, 3 plus 5 equals 8. After you solve that, you can start to look at the actual fractions. In this case, we have 1 sixth plus 3 fifths. We're going to do the cross multiplication method here. So we'll set it up and we'll take 1 times 5 to give us 5 and 6 times 3 to give us 18. Now we'll multiply the denominator. 6 times 5 is 30. Now that we have it set up, all we have to do is add 5 plus 18 to give us our answer of 23. That is our new numerator. Then we just drag over 30 into the denominator so we get 23 thirtieths. This means that our original problem of 3 and 1 sixth plus 5 and 3 fifths equals 8 and 23 thirtieths. How do you subtract mixed numbers? Now this method is a little bit different than adding. So let's take 6 and 2 thirds minus 4 and 1 half. To do this, we must first convert to improper fractions. To convert to improper fractions, you take the whole number times the denominator and add the numerator. So 6 times 3 plus 2 and 4 times 2 plus 1. When we do 6 times 3 plus 2, we'll get our answer of 20. And 4 times 2 is 8 plus 1 is 9. Now we have it set up. We have 20 thirds minus 9 halves. We'll set up our cross multiplication method and we'll multiply the denominators to give us 6. Then we take 2 times 20 is 40 and 3 times 9 is 27. Now we simply subtract. 40 minus 27 is 13 and we keep our denominator the same. 13 6 is an improper fraction so we must convert it to a mixed number. So we take 13 divided by 6. 13 divided by 6 is 2 remainder 1. Now we simply make 2 our whole number and 1 our new numerator keeping the denominator the same. So the answer is 2 and 1 sixth.